there's no need to say that we live in a demanding, fast-paced world. Everything needs to be done immediately, preferably by multitasking. We need to stay on top of our to-dos all the time, to keep up with work, with our personal life, with our home. It's like society wants us to keep doing more. We are expected to always answer our phone at any time, to answer all of our messages and emails within 10 minutes max, and to stay on top of everything. It's overwhelming. It's no wonder that sometimes we feel off. Luckily, there are easy ways to feel better and get everything back to a bearable level. Basically, simple ways to get your life and yourself together. Here's what I like to do to reset and recharge when I need it the most and what I think could work for you too. Making lists and writing down your thoughts. There's nothing worse than having the feeling of a pan-fried brain. Too much information, a giant salad of thoughts and feelings, appointments, deadlines, to-dos, and so on. Letting everything out, writing down anything you have in mind and making lists is the simplest and yet most effective way to achieve mental clarity and let go of that overwhelming brain fog. I like to do daily brain ups in the morning, making lists and writing things on my little desk calendar. Tidy up. Our space tends to be a reflection of how we feel. A disorganized, untidy space comes from a disorganized, untidy mind. Tidying our space up is like tidying up our life somehow. Tackling a little cleaning or tidying up project can give us back a sense of accomplishment, contentment, and balance. It can be anything from simply vacuuming around, folding laundry, or clearing a cluttered desk. Smartphone Detox Have you ever noticed that on days when you use your phone the most, you feel more tired, more overwhelmed, and somehow more frustrated than on other days? As much as smartphones have brought some positive things in our lives, they also have seemed to have taken over our lives. Every time we pull out our phone and quickly check it, our brain keeps processing thousands of information that we feed to it without even noticing. So make the conscious choice to leave your smartphone in a corner for a while and enjoy some quieter, more intentional, and more meaningful time. Self-care. Don't forget to make time for something fun, relaxing, or both. You need to take good care of yourself because you can't pour from an empty cup. I like to repeat this to myself often so I don't forget to be good and kind to myself. It can be anything. Making time for a good book, playing with your cat, binge watching your favorite show, quality time with someone you love, a solo date, a concert, going for a walk at a flea market. Anything works, as long as it makes you feel good and recharged. Which are your favorite things to do to get yourself together and recharge? Let me know down below. I hope you have enjoyed this video. If so, please like it, share it, leave a comment down below, and subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in my next one.